Hello, uh, my name is Art Gallery, and uh, I'm going to show you how to paint. Uh, I'm known kind of a, as a uh, abstract kind of an artist, but what I will do here will be less abstractive than normal. <clears throat> so I've got my uh, paints here on my uh, tray, and uh, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to put some yellow. It'll be kind of, uh, I call this kind of paint yellow stuts, yellow sun. So. I'm using a circular motion to make a circle. There. We're off to a great start. Now I'm going to uh, get up for a second. And I'm going to get some water because I'm changing the colors now from yellow. So I'm going to clean that and remember later not to drink this. <laughs> okay, here we go now. And I'm switching from my brush, which this is called a, a small brush, and I'm going to get the uh, lar larger brush. And we're going to make some green. And uh, this will be the grass. It seems like I've run out of some green, so I'm going to put some other color in. I'm uh, unfortunately colorblind, so it doesn't really matter to me. And that's usually why I make abstract paintings. So as you can see, uh, the lines on the painting are uh, kind of, uh, I forget the word. Now this is when it gets to be kind of wild and abstracty. See, if you look at my paintings for quite a while, especially after smoking for a bit, you can really see some, some things come into focus from the paintings. Sometimes what I like to do is close my eyes and just let my intuitions, or whatever the word's called, come into play. I actually had my eyes open, but you don't need to know that. I don't know about you, but my wife is going to kill me later because I think I got some paint on the floor. floor. <laughs> Now, what some people uh, have said about my paintings is uh, sometimes there are like uh, spirits or something that are coming through the paintings and uh, like right there, right there you can see it's like a face and there's uh, two eyes and kind of a nose and a smile. And uh, that's just wonderful the way it just kind of comes out. So we're almost done.
Now, if I wasn't colorblind, I think I would be even more amazed at my work. I'm almost done, believe it or not. And then I initial uh, my painting with a uh, A and a G, and that stands for Art Gallery. I hope I don't run out of paints. I try to make my initials large enough for uh, people to see them. A, G, there it is. Although, uh, kind of looks more like an A6, but it's AG. Okay, so, uh, and I will be selling this on eBay, uh, so, uh, make an offer. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Art Gallery, and I hope you've learned how to paint. Thank you.